In the prehistoric world, 66 million years ago, the Earth was home to a diverse array of creatures, including dinosaurs, marine reptiles, and flying animals. But at the end of the Cretaceous period, a mass extinction event occurred that wiped out 75% of all species on Earth. Among these extinct creatures were the dinosaurs, who had ruled our planet for over 165 million years. However, life found a way to return, and new types of creatures emerged from the ashes. Among these creatures was a small, mouse-sized mammal called Trisopodon. Trisopodon lived in North America during the Paleocene epoch, the first geological period after the Cretaceous extinction. Trisopodon was an early mammal belonging to a group called Multituberculata. Multituberculates were a successful group of mammals that lived for over 100 million years, from the Triassic to the Miocene epoch. They were characterized by their multicusp teeth, which were used to grind food, including seeds, nuts, and insects. Trisopodon was a small animal, measuring about 10 centimeters in length and weighing around 20 grams. It had a slender body, a long tail, and short legs. It also had a thick fur coat, which helped protect it from the cold. Trisopodon was a nocturnal animal, and it fed on insects and fruit. It had a strong sense of smell, which helped it find food in the dark. It also had sharp teeth, which helped it tear apart its prey. Trisopodon was a social animal, and it lived in small groups. It communicated with others through sounds and signals. It was also a shy animal, and it would hide in burrows or trees when it felt threatened. Trisopodon went extinct about 55 million years ago, during the Eocene epoch. The reason for its extinction is unknown, but it is thought that it may have been due to climate change or competition with other mammals.